Hello, welcome to Liverpool FC News Today channel. Saturday was a memorable day for Liverpool and a couple of players in particular. After goals from Diogo Jota and Takumi Minamino put the Reds 2,0 up against Cardiff City in their fourth round FA Cup tie, two other stars took centre stage. Harvey Elliott, returning to action after five months out with injury, added a fine third. Liverpool fans also got a glimpse of their new January signing Luis Diaz, as he enjoyed a lively debut coming off the bench. It was the ideal start to a big week for the Reds, with Mohamed Salah and Sadio Main returning from the Africa Cup of Nations and some crucial fixtures to negotiate in the Premier League. How many trophies can Liverpool win this season? Let us know in the comments section below. Liverpool boss Jurgen Klopp has said Diaz was sent a warning by team, mates after the winger was on the end of some rough challenges against Cardiff. The Colombian took a few knocks and one particularly heavy blow to the knee, prompting some initial concern among the Liverpool staff. However, Diaz was able to get to his feet and continue playing. Speaking afterwards, Klopp said Diaz had been roughed up but had no major issues. He has a cut and a bruise, everybody told him welcome to England, he said. He will maybe have a little scar to remember his first game, but he is all good. All fine. Read the story in full here. Former Manchester United midfielder Roy Keane believes Salah is in charge when it comes to his contract situation at Liverpool. The forwards deal is set to expire at the end of next season and as of yet the club and the player have not come to an agreement over an extension. As a result, fears are gradually growing among the Liverpool fan base that Salah may be on the move in the next 18 months and Keane said the power is in the players' hands at the moment. As a result, they might not have a choice, it's up to the player, the players in charge. He said he's happy and he's obviously going to try and negotiate a bit of steel but he's going to, to get a lot of money anyway, said the Irishman. It might be does he want a new experience. But he's said a number of times he's happy here he's loved here but Liverpool have got to try and get him signed you can't just let players like that go out of the door, particularly on a free. Read the story in full here. Given he only arrived in Liverpool on Friday, it wasn't clear whether Diaz would be involved on Sunday. And with the small time frame he's had to acclimatise and train. Fans will be very encouraged with what they saw from Diaz. The former Porto man set up Minamino after coming on, as he and Jota capitalised on some comedic defending from Cardiff. Additionally, there were moments of class throughout Diaz's outing, while his ability to carry the ball at speed was on display a number of times as Liverpool countered. With Salah and Main potentially back and available for Thursday's clash with Leicester City, it will be intriguing to see what role a new man has to play in the short term. Read the story in full here. <laughs>